hello everyone and welcome back to our channel for today's video we will walk you through the process of connecting facebook messenger to google sheets with zapier but before we dive into all of it make sure you hit the subscribe button below and ring the notification bell so you never miss out on our latest content now connecting your facebook messenger to google sheets will give you a lot of advantages number one because it it'll allow you to automate repetitive tasks so you can set up uh, a trigger when specific events occur in facebook messenger such as uh, receiving a new message or new comment on a post and it automatically updates your google sheets spreadsheets so uh, this automation alone saves you time and reduces manual data entry with um zapier you can ensure that your google sheets are updated in real time as soon as new data is available on facebook messenger this can be particularly valuable for tracking and managing customer inquiries or engagement on your Facebook page, right? You can customize your zaps to fit your specific needs. For example, you can specify which data from Facebook Messenger you want to record in Google Sheets and how it should be formatted. So what we should do first is go here in Zapier um, apps because we're going to connect Facebook Messenger to Google Sheets. So we need to click uh, the orange button here facebook messenger to a 6000 plus apps right so the first action is going to trigger facebook messenger if you can see the uh, small um plus sign here going to click on that and all you got to do is check google sheets it's already given here all right so since um, Zapier connects with numerous other apps and services, so you can extend uh, the functionality of your integration. For, in for example, you can um, set up Zaps to send email notification when specific events occur in your Google Sheet right here. All right. And also, um, for example, your data in Google Sheets is easily accessible and shareable with uh, team members, making it a valuable collaborative tool. All right. So what we should do now is to um, authenticate these apps so before doing that make sure you have logged into your uh, facebook messenger account as well as the google sheets account and once you're ready all you're gonna do is click on it and authenticate these apps and after doing that all you're gonna do is relax because zapier will do the rest of the work for you thank you so much for watching and i'll see you all in the next one